You Decide 2010, Marcy Kaptur and Rich Ayat squared off yet again in Sandusky today, the latest in a series of debates in the race for the 9th Congressional District seat. Fox Toledo's Kevin Milliken is live to bring us the latest on the Nazi controversy affecting the race. Republican Rich Hyatt remained defensive about wearing an SS uniform in a war reenactment that has put Northwest Ohio in the national headlines and served as a punchline for political commentators and comedians. This way, my family would be out in the street. The Nazi controversy is staying as hot as the Java served at the Sandusky Coffee House, where today's debate was held. Republican Rich Ayotte peppered with questions from the crowd. Did he ever wear a swastika armband? That is prohibited in the reenactment world because the armband is a political statement. In retrospect, would you have participated in the reenactment in the manner of which you portrayed a, a Waffen SS officer? Uh, absolutely, just just as I played a GI, just as I uh, as I played the role of a, of a Union soldier. An emotional Marcy Captor took I to task for what she saw as flippant remarks. What offends me about what I have learned is your lack of empathy and understanding of how your actions might have affected others. But the Republican challenger stated his reenactment days would be over if elected to Congress. Uh, don't have time. <laughs> okay. That response appeared to yet again anger his Democratic opponent. Because no one should trivialize this question. The debate, of course, covered other topics, health care reform, earmarks, taxes, free trade. But it's hard to tell how much of an effect the Nazi controversy is having. Unlike statewide races, governor, senator, where the numbers are well known, no polls have gone public, although both camps are keeping track. Reporting live, Kevin Milliken, Fox Toledo News.